Hello everyone, nice to see you again. We hope you like our videos. You can hit the bell and subscribe so you don't miss a video. Thank you for watching and we look forward to seeing you again. Edouard de Bar Ponsan, a captivating journey into artistic expression. Edouard de Bar Ponsan, a renowned French artist of the late 19th and early 20th centuries, captivated audiences with his exceptional artistic talent and dedication to capturing the essence of his subjects. Born on November 29, 1847, in Toulouse, France, de Bar Ponsan's journey through the world of art would leave an indelible mark on the history of painting. De Bar Ponsan's artistic inclinations were apparent from an early age. He pursued his passion by enrolling at the École des Beaux-Arts in Toulouse, where he received formal training in painting. His dedication and skill led him to win several prestigious awards, including the Prix de Rome in 1876, which allowed him to study at the esteemed French Academy in Rome. The influences of de Bar Ponsan's time in Rome can be seen in his work, particularly in his attention to detail and his ability to capture the play of light and shadow. After returning to France, he settled in Paris and became an active member of the artistic community. He found success as a portraitist, gaining recognition for his ability to portray the personality and character of his subjects. One of de Bar Ponsan's notable works is his painting titled The Return from the Harvest, 1878. This masterpiece showcases his talent for depicting everyday life with a touch of nostalgia and romanticism. The painting depicts a group of peasants returning from the fields, their weary faces and tired postures conveying the arduousness of their work. De Bar Ponsan's fearful use of colors and light adds depth and atmosphere to the scene, evoking a sense of serenity and tranquility. Another significant work by de Bar Ponsan is The Prodigal Son, 1881. In this painting, he depicts the biblical parable of the prodigal son, emphasizing the emotional turmoil and the subsequent redemption. Through his careful brushstrokes and attention to facial expressions, de Bar Ponsan conveys the remorse and despair of the prodigal son, as well as the compassion and forgiveness of his father. The painting serves as a testament to de Bar Ponsan's ability to capture profound human emotions on canvas. De Bar Ponsan's artistic prowess extended beyond portraiture and genre scenes. He also delved into historical and social themes, often infusing his works with political commentary. One of his most significant political paintings is The Assassination of the Duke of Guise, 1907. This dramatic composition depicts the murder of the Duke of Guise during the French Wars of Religion. Through his meticulous attention to historical accuracy and his use of dynamic composition, de Bar Ponsan conveys the intensity and violence of the event, inviting viewers to reflect on the complexities of power and political intrigue. Throughout his career, de Bar Ponsan demonstrated a remarkable ability to adapt his style to different subjects and genres. He transitioned effortlessly between historical scenes, religious themes, and portraits, all while maintaining a distinct artistic voice. His versatility and technical prowess earned him the admiration and respect of his contemporaries. Beyond his artistic achievements, de Bar Ponsan was also an influential teacher. He served as a professor at the École des Beaux-Arts, where he mentored numerous aspiring artists, imparting his knowledge and passion for painting. His dedication to education left a lasting impact on the development of French art.